Today we're gonna look at Zhiyun Rebuild S whether it is compatible with Canon 200D, 250D or SL2. Let's get started. First if you go to Zhiyun website and go to Rebuild S, you go to the downloads you see the manuals in here and then if you click on camera compatible list it will show you the list of all the cameras that are compatible with this gimbal but when you look down the list in the Canon side you don't see Canon 200D or 250D or SL2 so I want to show you whether it would work on this gimbal or not so let's get started from the bundle of USB cables that you have got you need to select the one with the micro USB and mini USB take the micro USB and then connect it firmly to the bottom port of the tilt axis motor and connect the other end of the cable which is the mini USB to the camera now let's turn on the gimbal now turn on the camera and set it to video mode if you see a symbol like this what you have to do is to press on the LV button and now camera is ready for filming so now we have set up the camera with the cable and we can control it using the gimbal for example the first setting we can change is the aperture value which you can adjust the aperture priority by just turning the knob clockwise and anti-clockwise to decrease and increase the values so if you press right on the panel you will go to time value time value means shutter speed or shutter priority and by turning the knob clockwise and anti-clockwise you can increase and decrease its value and if you press right again you will go to ISO settings as the previous modes you can increase and decrease set it to auto to choose another mode you have to press the back button if you press couple of times you go back to the initial setting which was aperture value to record just press the red button once and it will start recording without you touching the camera as you can see here it is recording to stop recording just press the red button again and now it's not recording anymore just make sure that this wire won't get locked between the arms because I had this experience when I was running the gimbal that this wire sometimes was coming on the way and it was kind of locking the arms and not letting it to move. The conclusion is that Canon 200D, 250D and SL2 they all work with Rebuild S. I hope this video was useful. If it was, please don't forget to watch my other videos on my left and to subscribe to support my channel. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye.